Okay, looks like we are live. Let me know if you can hear me and see me. Robert is on the call. Wait. Wendy, Mike. Murray is here. Mark, Ruth. And this is where I should be making up a whole bunch of names to make it sound like there's just thousands of people pouring on here. <laughs> <laughs> Ernest, John. Magic Matt. That one I haven't heard before. Uh, only John calls me that. Or Rambo. There's a software will, that will make the, the names up for you. Yeah, and it should be showing you those names, too, and all of the comments. Like, oh, man, it's like the busiest webinar in history. Call me Harry is on the call. <laughs> is that Mark's software, is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pat is on the call. Okay, where is everybody from? I know my good friend uh, John. He's from uh, Dublin. Dallas. Oh, Toronto. Tirana. If you're from uh, Toronto, you don't say Toronto. You say Tirana. Straight, Straight out. out of the shower. <laughs> don't turn your webcam on. Colorful Colorado. I love that state. Beautiful, beautiful place. Dallas, we got Hermiston, Oregon, San Antonio, beautiful place, beautiful. Yeah, I'd like to go there. <clears throat> I've been to just about all of these places. And Matthew, he's been to like one place in the United States, Florida. Yeah. And I've been to Vancouver about a million times. <laughs> yeah. You were traveling so many times there, you were getting tired of it. Yeah, I had to have a different job title every time I went because I was getting worried I was going to get thrown back out. <laughs> <laughs> Massachusetts. Oh, two from San Antonio. What are the odds? Mike and Michael. Oh. Huh. <laughs> Something's a little fishy there. Mike and Michael are both from San Antonio. What are the odds? Two people from the same city in the same group with the same name from the same place or probably from the same neighborhood. Oh, maybe it's Mike Jr. from downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, we're just about ready to go. Wow, we are ready to go. Let's go. What have we got on the go? Matthew Houghton, Miracle Magical Matthew, is launching his very first design pack with mock ups. And what do you know? It's all based on Magical Trump. Now, the call isn't political, but remember, politics sell. You know, Taking a look at some of the people that we have in our group that are definitely, well, I don't know if they're Trump supporters or not, but they're selling Trump stuff. And, you know, I was taking a look at that, uh, the one message in three weeks, uh, $14,000 in sales on a brand new Etsy store. And now having multiple thousand dollar days. Hmm. Trump sells, talking with 
Mr. Medford Park, also known as Randy Park from Printec. He says out of every five items leaving their facility, four of them are Trump products. So, uh, just so that everyone knows, you know, I, I don't uh, care whether you love Trump or you hate Trump. I mean, I was happy to, uh, and I, I still have no problem selling Democrat uh, gear if it would sell. It just doesn't sell. Uh, we spent a lot of money testing it and trying it. We just couldn't get it to sell. Anyway, we're here to make money. Trump's making us a bunch of money because the Trump lovers are fanatics. And trust me, there's some dingbat Republicans as crazy as some dingbat Democrats. So, you know, there's there's Looney Tunes on both sides of the fence. <laughs> My good friend Randy from Printec, he tends to lean on the other side of that fence. It's like, oh man, you're over the top there, Medford. Now he's a good guy. Excellent guy. Let me see. Uh, let me see. Yeah, this is all uh, about making money. This isn't about us promoting Trump so that he can get reelected. I don't know how we would do that. It's not to, to express our political views. We're not on the campaign trail. We're on the campaign trail for money. Big money. <clears throat> you know, I was looking at a couple of these sellers on Etsy. The one uh, person is selling in between 3,300 and 3,500 face masks a day. And they're the, the, the cotton mask with the elastic. They look really good. He must have got them out of China because he's got a really low price, but 3,500 masks a day. How do you even mail that many a day? How many people do you have to have that are setting that up? I mean, that's absolutely crazy. Um, taking a look at Black Lives Matter, you know, some simple trends, you know, whether you're for Black Lives Matter or All Lives Matter, or Blue Lives Matter, or Any Life Matters, even dogs' lives matter now. People pick up dog poop. I don't pick up dog poop. If I walk that dog where it poops, that's where it's... I'm not picking up poop. But anyway, all lives matter. But I was looking at this one store that was selling Black Lives Matter. It was, uh, I don't know, it was like a little patch that they were making with the, an embroidered patch. And I don't know what you'd sew that on to, but anyway... This person was just selling thousands of these crazy things. It's not about our political uh, agenda or, um, you know, it, it really is about jumping on the trends, whether we like those trends. Now, some of the trends I would just never support. And you don't have to support every trend that comes along just because you're here to make money. I mean, you draw the line somewhere. For example, I would never promote anything that had to do with uh, abortion. Like, I would never put out Proud Baby Killer. I don't think it would sell very well, and uh, it's just something that I would never promote, and I don't care how much money would be involved. We've got some people in the group that are that way about Trump. We've got some that are that way about the, the Democrat side. I draw the line when it comes to killing babies in America, Canada, and worldwide. I don't think proud baby killer. I don't think that thing is going to sell a lot of shirts. Anyway, that's where I draw the line. Uh, let me see. Uh, I sell the Trump uh, poopy masks. Hey, that's awesome. You can make money. Uh, I actually noticed that there's a lot of people buying stuff on uh, that are anti-Trump things. And, you know... You put the name Trump on, on a product, even if it's I hate Trump or I love Trump, you're going to sell both ways. So you can jump on the Trump train and it can be on the negative side. So remember, even if you don't like Trump, there's still a lot of money to be made in marketing Trump on the other side. 
you know, Trump's an idiot. Hey, if you can put that on a t-shirt and sell it, knock yourself out. Let me see. Um, uh, yeah, these are brand new designs. Um, we put out a, a pack previously, and then Matthew just uh, came up with his own design pack, and he's got the uh, mock-ups. Uh, let me see. Even marketing on Facebook with all their political uh, restrictions. <clears throat> you know, we're just not using Facebook right now. Right now, we're just doing just about everything is, well, right now, everything is Etsy. Um, you, you know, the cost per conversion is ridiculously cheap. And, you know, we actually had um, two designs that we had to take down because we could not keep up with, you know, getting their designs made. And, you know, dealing with the customer support and going back and forth with the customers. They just love this thing. We put this design up and we literally had to take uh, turn the ads off. And I don't know, did we even delete those, Matthew? Are they gone? Yeah, we took them off. Yeah, it was too much. So. <clears throat> and we still, yeah, we just, we still we just could not physically keep up with it. We're still getting messages now Ken, for people wanting those mugs. Like, <laughs> <laughs> so how much are the ads compared to Etsy? How do you advertise for Etsy? Oh, they've got the world's simplest advertising thing. You just select your budget. You select which uh, products you want them to promote. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> I just gave you the full Etsy course on running ads. <laughs> yeah, you just go to Etsy marketing in your dashboard and and it's so simple. Here's my budget. And we've got so many people that are running $5 uh, budgets and still making lots and lots of money. One person in our group is doing almost $40,000 a month. Uh, in Etsy sales, and he runs uh, five to fifteen dollars a day in ad spend. So anyway, yeah, you select your budget and which ads you want to run ads to. Right in the uh, Etsy dash. Uh, Facebook just keeps failing. Yeah, we're not even running. We just gave up on on that. We just totally gave up. Uh, let me see. Well, I don't know what that one is. Uh, I do, I know how to set up Etsy. I have a store there already for jewelry. Yeah, you can sell. Uh, I, I cannot believe. Like we showed people in our group and, and we've got these people doing all kinds of big sales. And, you know, I go in and take a look at their store and all I did is just copied our designs. Isn't that right, John? Isn't that right, <laughs> JC? Aren't some of your best sellers the ones that you just completely... <laughs> he says, cough, cough. <laughs> <laughs> we got people, oh boy, I'm making thousands of dollars on my store. Oh, what are you selling? Oh, I just copied all your designs. <laughs> yeah, we don't mind showing off our store. We don't mind that at all. We'll actually show you uh, show you both of our stores that we use for demo stores here. One we're just uh, just getting set up. Anyway, we'll definitely show you that. But let's get on to the Trump stuff. Uh, Matthew put together um, I don't know it's like ten designs, and he's got the mockups on all of the products. And I'm going to let Matthew. I'm going to let him jump on and show. Uh, what the pack looks like. So you get a quick look at it. And then uh, I'm going to show you some of my ideas with that pack. And then I'm going to show you how to make some money with this pack. And I'm going to give you a few of the marketing tips that are going to help you make money with this pack or a previous pack or don't buy a pack. I'm even going to give something here to uh, everyone that's on the call whether you sell on Etsy or you buy his 
his funny design pack or not, it doesn't matter. I'm going to make sure that when you leave here that you are more than happy. So get ready to be happy. Anyway, Matthew, why don't you share your screen and then I'll share my screen after you share your screen. Why don't you give everyone a quick walkthrough? Yeah. And I'm going to turn off my, my – or you're going to share your screen. And uh, Matthew, I'm going to be right back. The coffee is going through me, if you know what I mean. <laughs> okay, so uh, can everyone hear me? Because Michael just said he can't hear me very well. So can you all hear me? It could be my internet connection. Yep. Okay, you're good. Yep. Okay. I'm oh, still not. Yeah, so, turn up your volume, you peanut head. Yeah, it looks like everyone else can hear me, Michael, so I'm not sure it must be your end. So what I'm going to do is just show you in my folders uh, the pack so you can see what's inside. So uh, I guess a lot of you guys are um, on are using Printex, a locker stock. So in fact, I'll show you that first because anybody who is... Um, Right, let me share my screen. Anybody who is using locker stock can get a locker stock push. So, could you? Um, I've only got one screen, so I'm gonna have to jump back and forth here. <laughs> That's my wife, that is Mike. <laughs> I didn't mean to show that. <laughs> Okay, so anybody who is on Locker Stock, basically there is 11 designs here. They're all made for light and dark, and they're all loaded up in Locker Stock. And ready to go. There's a mix of personalized and non personalized. Uh, the Trump ones are particularly difficult to personalize, so we've done our best to personalize them as much as we can. But here you can see them set up in Locker Stock. Now, I'll show you all the mock ups and stuff in a minute, but when you do personalized stuff in locker stock you've got to use the locker stock uh in mock uh, mock-up images so they that's easy enough to flip out on the other end depending on which store you push them to any of us that are set up with the mock-ups there and they're all tagged and stuff like that so if you're using shopify and you shoot these into your shopify store uh they should all be tagged with the product name and the design name so you can create your collections real real quick and I'll show you all the mock-ups and stuff in a minute, but there's about uh, five and a half or six and a half pages, and I think there's 30 products per page here. So you've got a ton of products, um, and you can always expand that out as well. But literally, this took me a week to, to make all these mock-ups and set all this stuff up. So um, just the, the work alone, apart from the designs, it is a huge time saver. And I'm just going to quickly flip back and make sure everything's all right. Yeah. Okay, so there's that. Then I'm going to show you inside uh, the pack. And if I just do a quick search here for JPEGs here, I can show you all the mock-ups here because you have uh, 311 mock-ups. So everything's mocked up and ready to go. These mock-ups are made with Placeit. You know, I'm sure everybody knows, uh, everyone knows Placeit. So you probably, or you may want to change out your mock-ups at some point, entirely up to you, but it's, you know, they're ready for you to get straight out the gate with, and you can get these up on your store uh, real, real quick. And literally, I'm going to scroll quick. There's just hundreds of them. So the whole pack um, comes with all these mock-ups and all the locker stock set up as well. So you've got a massive, uh, you know, massive um, amount of stuff to work with there. So what I will do is I'll put the link for the website in the chat. Hopefully you can see it in the chat. And I sell, so this one is the Trump pack here. Uh, you can also buy them as single designs. And if you want to have a look in your own time at those designs, you can go to the single design page and you can have a good look at those there. And what I'm going to do is drop that in there. Hopefully you guys will get to see that. Uh, if you can't see it, the URL is designsforpod.com, okay, and that will take you there as well. I'm not sure if you'll see that in the chat. I'm not too familiar with Demio. Um, and I'll show you, here's the single designs here. <clears throat> Hopefully, if it will load. A 
Okay, so you can see it. If you click the images, you'll be able to have a better look at it and you'll be able to scroll down and see what mockups are included. I've done four mockups across seven products, um, uh, two light, two dark for each product. And I also have an affiliate uh, platform if anyone's interested in that. Check that out as well. And we'll see how it goes. So I started off with a Trump pack purely because uh, Randy was saying what a massive seller it is in, in uh, Printex. And depending on how things go will depend on whether I bring more and more uh, packs out as well. So I've tried to buy packs myself over the years and I know it, uh, you know there's a lot of crap out there and this definitely is not going to be like that. These are top quality designs. Uh, everything should be uh, very good because a lot of these designers out there are designers, not marketers. So um, I'm kind of bringing together my experience with the designs as well and hopefully handing it to you on a plate so that everything's nice and straightforward and simple for you so you can get these up real quick. So with that said, uh, you know, that's pretty much the site and everything. I've got a couple of other uh, products on here if you want to check those out as well. But really to kick this site off with, it's the Trump pack to start with. So uh, go and check that out, have a look. I'm sure you're going to like it a lot. Um, you know, they're top, it's a top quality designer. They cost me a lot of money to have them made. Uh, they're lovely designs, um, you know, and I'm sure it'll, it'll be great for you. So I will um, stop sharing my screen. And if anyone has any questions, uh, let me know in the chat and I'll answer any questions. Oh, Matthew, somebody is asking about infringement issues with Trump designs. Yeah, I guess there could be infringement. I don't, I mean, Trump could sue anyone he wants, I, I guess. I don't know if he would win or not, but the fact is, I think Trump is delighted to be um, having his name everywhere. I think he loves all the advertising he's getting. And I know I've worked on a number of projects, even with Randy, and it's all been Trump stuff. And we've never had any any issue. Yeah. Yeah, let me, can I, uh, let me just explain about these. So on the design packs page, you'll see the Trump pack. Uh, only the big packs will get the locker stock push. So the individual designs, what will happen when you buy those, you'll get an email and you'll basically get the files to download and then you will have to upload those to whatever platform you're using. So, um, and somebody said, if you want to skip, and if we want to skip doing our, designs for POD is where we go if we want to skip doing our own mock-ups. Yeah, so if you buy... If you buy any of the designs, then you will get the mock-ups with them all. But if you just buy the whole big uh, 11 uh, designs trump pack, then you will get the locker stock push, which means you get everything set up for you in locker stock. And the pack price, somebody asked, uh, the pack price is $47. Yeah, my okay. the Trump pack. <clears throat> so now, Matthew, did you show them all of the uh, the mockups, the style of the mockups? Yep, showed them all the mockups. Yeah. Okay, good. So anyway, let's take a look at things. We're going to try and make this uh, a little uh, a wee bit interesting here. I'm going to share my screen. And remember, Matthew is giving you, you get the designs and you get the pre-made mock-ups. Uh, but we're going to try and make something um, interesting here. Okay, let me share my screen. You've seen his mock-ups. And now let's take a look at my screen. And there, uh, can everybody see my screen? Yep. Excellent. 
Okay, so this is one of the mock-ups that um, we've made available in our store. So, of course, we can just turn our designs. Uh, let's see. Uh, this is what the mock-up looks like without the frame. This is just for the dramatics, I guess. Uh, anyway, this is one of our mock-ups here. It's a little bit different, uh, a different style than Matthew is using. We don't use a lot of people in our mock-ups. It's more about creating a, a mood, um, uh, a feeling. It's about telling a, a story. And I just went through them on a couple of our mock-ups so that you could see what they look like. Um, you know, if you're just getting the designs, you can throw Matthew's designs on anything you like. Uh, let's just take a look at a, a couple that we have here. And then I'll show you the, the little store that uh, Matthew and myself are just setting up. It's still very, very new. Uh, anyway, some ideas, you know, to, to put the designs on different products. It's not just uh, for uh, T-shirts. Uh, right now, mugs are a big seller for us. And anyway, let's take a look at a few of the other ideas. Now, this one is very simple. You know, whether you're on um, Shopify or you're selling on Etsy, we recommend that you respond to all buyers with a thank you card, a, a digital thank you card, where you say thanks for your purchase. And of course, we use, you know, one of our backgrounds like this. I'll show you some of the others here in a second, but you can put Matthew's designs right on these digital cards uh, it's actually another thing that you could sell. Anyway, let's take a look. There's one of Randy's uh, tote bags. Um, you know, it's just a different feel with the um, the mock-ups than having the model there holding the coffee cup, smiling and pointing off in the distance. Um, they're they're absolutely fantastic. But like I said, if you buy the designs, you can put them on your own mock-ups, and you can. Uh, uh, some people make their own mock-ups. We are using our own mock-ups for everything that we sell right now. Everything. All of our Trump mugs, we used our own uh, mock-ups. We shoot the photos and we do the whole bit. There's another one of Randy's. Uh, oh, there's one of Matthew's designs, of course, on the tin coffee cup. And of course, there's your standard mug. You know, this design has been a really big seller. And I know that, you know, Father's Day marketing is now done, finished, and over. Uh, but Matthew put the designs in here so that it's personalized with the first name and their their job title. And he's got the, the designs that are based on uh, birth years, the most popular years, different, uh, you know, different ideas beyond Father's Day. We think that Trump marketing is going to get stronger and stronger and stronger. And we think it's going to, of course, go right to the, the lovely and much uh, anticipated November the 3rd. And we think that it's going to go um, right into December. We think it's going to be a huge part of the Christmas rush. And let's take a look we also have some now we already had this uh this girl was at my place we shot the photo and then what i did is i went to the park yesterday and i just shot a bunch of backgrounds so i've got like 10 different backgrounds and i've got all of the models you know all set up in spots like this you know i i don't know if having the model on there is as good as you know, having something like this for myself, I, I I don't know which is better. I know which one I like better, but I don't know which one is going to sell better for you. Uh, you know, you've got your, your regular T-shirt on a white background. I find that one very, very boring. Um, I really like stuff like this. You know, so many people are missing out on marketing on the back of the product. And there's a lot of people that just do not want the design on their chest. There's a lot of people that want the design on the back. So, of course, we have the mock-ups, you know, that show 
the the front and back with all the different uh, all the different scenes. Ah, oh, there's one. It's a lovely park. It's a lovely park. Anyway, what we want to do is this. I'm going to, just so we don't take up all of your day, although I don't really care if I take up all of your day. I'm just saying that because it's what you're supposed to say. You know, we need, we'll get through it. We don't want to waste your time. We know your time is valuable. Uh, how do I know if your time is valuable? <laughs> it may not be valuable. Anyway, here's what we want to do. Um, I'm showing you our store here right now. It's brand new. It's called the Mockup Mall. Matthew's going to create a 50% off coupon code. And here's what we're going to do. If you will go in and make one purchase and you're going to get it for half price, so it's going to cost you like, I don't know, what's it going to cost you? 90 cents. Matthew is going to put together 10, you, you buy any single mock-up in this store. And this is whether you buy Matthew's pack or you don't buy his pack. This is for everyone that's on the call. He's going to get you a unique 50% uh, off coupon code. And if you make one purchase, Matthew is going to put together 10 of our best-selling mock-ups. You don't get to pick which ones. Matthew said he's just going to put together 10 of our best-selling mock-ups, a mixture of everything that we have on the store. When you make the purchase, it's going to collect your email. Uh, so you don't have to worry about anything. Uh, tomorrow, Matthew is going to group together 10 of these, and he's going to send them out to you. So you're going to get 10 of these. Um, and one of them is going to be our thank you cards. We just sell a lot of these. This mug right here just does, I and I don't know what it is, but this one just does really well for us. It's a pack of 10. It's got all the different flowers. Anyway, that one sells like crazy. And we're going to make sure that we get you... Uh, uh, in that pack is going to be one of the thank you sets. Uh, and it looks basically something like this. We have a number of these, but um, this one here actually has all the flowers as well. But this just works wonders. If you have uh, Photoshop and you can make a, a personalized, if you have a PSD that you always have open and you see that the buyer's name was Cheryl, you just quickly go in and it actually just says, hi, Cheryl, just wanted to say thanks for your order. We're working on it now. <clears throat> Customers will think that you are amazing just because you sent them a thank you message. Somebody makes a purchase, you send them a personalized message just like that. Or the one with the single card, we're going to add these uh, tonight but something as simple as this. And it's just got the, the, the string here and it's got the little clothespin and it just has a card and it just says, hey Susan, thanks for your purchase. We appreciate our customers and we're working on your order now. It's just a great way to respond to a new customer. So we're gonna make sure that you get that. And then, of course, uh, if most people sell on Printec, we're going to make sure that you get some tote bag mock-ups in that uh, pack of 10. Um, we really like these mock-ups. I got this little, whatever it's called, this some sort of a blanket, a Sherpa, Sherpy, a Sher I don't know, some Sharpie, sh some type of uh, material that we're using in the back, and it just adds a little bit of depth to it, so... Uh, anyway, it's pretty cool. And uh, the tin mugs, uh, of course, people love this one. I just threw it down on my lawn and the sun was setting and I just snapped a shot. And uh, people like this one. I don't know what it is. Anyway, you need to make a purchase and you need to leave a review. If you'll make a purchase and leave a review, we are going to check to make sure that you've made a purchase and that will give us your email. And we're gonna check to make sure that you left a review. And if you did that, then Matthew's gonna send you 10 of our mock-ups. 
um, and it'll be a mixture of everything. Uh, a couple of our best-selling designs, a uh, whole bunch of, um, you know, mugs, thank you cards. This thank you card is really cool. It's really simple. It just says thank you. And, of course, uh, you know, he'll pick a little bit of everything. You don't get to pick what you what you want, what you really, really want. Anyway, Matthew's going to put that together. He said, we need to make sure that people leave with something that's amazing, even if they don't uh, support the, the Trump uh, design pack. So anyway, there you have it. Uh, let's take a look at some questions. Oh, yeah, Matthew, we need to give them the, or I'll just grab this right here. Okay. Yeah, you need to make the purchase on the Etsy store for, but Matthew's going to give you that. Did you get them their coupon code, Matthew? I do know. What, uh, how much was the discount again? 50% off any purchase in the store. And we're going to make make that a unique code so we can make it disappear in a couple of days. Yeah. And you just have to buy one item that'll and give leave us a review. And Matthew will send you out your 10 bonus free mock-ups. And once again, you don't get to pick what they are. We're just giving you an assortment. And I didn't want to give you anything. It was Matthew's wise idea to uh, make sure that everybody got something that was amazing. I just said, screw it. Don't give them a thing. They don't need anything. Anyway, our cool coffee cup thing is in there. And, uh, you know, I think they look pretty darn good. But... That could be my, uh, I could be biasing. I'm the one who's taking the photos. And man, I'm telling you, I get some strange looks when I'm down there shopping for <laughs> jewelry and, and, uh, and, uh, and ladies clothes. I'm getting some strange looks. <laughs> you know, for all of these here, yeah buying the the flowers this one was a a good one i go to the to the counter and i've got all of this stuff and i got this swimsuit and flip flops and these little shorts and uh and the lady looks at me and uh looks at the products again and i said lady i said give me a break i said I said, look at the size of these clothes. And then she said, oh, oh, right. Uh, do you, you, you have a daughter? I, my daughter wouldn't fit these little tiny clothes. These are the smallest things I can find so that I can do my photos or they won't fit on the board. Everything has to be a super small. Otherwise, they just don't, uh, they just don't uh, fit on the image. Anyway, it's been quite uh, an adventure down there shopping for these clothes. And I don't, I just use my color wheel to try and make sure that my colors match because <laughs> I am not color coordinated at all, as you can probably see. And I had a whole bunch of these, uh, I've got like 180 pairs of these shoes, so I tried to put them in. I actually went and bought this top just because I had orange shoes. <laughs> uh, that one was funny. It's not even the same orange, but I guess it's orange enough, I don't know. How about the different hats? There's a couple that uh, that just really seem to stand out. This hat right here stands out really well. Oh, this hat does well um, for us and the other hat. Anyway, like I said, we could be biased. We think that they look great, but who knows? Uh, do you put the designs on them in Photoshop? Uh, no, you can use Canva, which is free. And yeah, it just comes without the design and you just put your design here. Literally, this tells you everything. Your design goes here. We use Canva or Photoshop or pretty much anything that, that because you're just getting the blank and then you just drop your design on there. And that is exactly what I was just showing. I can go back here and show you uh, this one right here. 
this is what they look like. They just come blank. And then you can put any design on that you like. And it does come with a training video as well, doesn't it, Ken? And you do yeah, when you make the, the purchase from the mock-up mall, you get the, the training on, on how to put your design on an item. So, yeah, it's it's pretty pretty simple. You just put it on there, and, yeah, you're good to go. Same thing, like I said, with the, the mug. You can just put uh, any design on here that you like. Although I thought it would have been interesting to have a variation of this one. Amanda, your birthday will be huge. And I'll get Mexico to pay for it. I actually would have said I'll get your friends to pay for it. That's what I would have done. <laughs> Anyway, I just threw a bunch. You can see what it looks like uh, right on here. It's very simple. Just drop them on and away you go. And we found that, you know, a night and day difference by using good quality mock-ups instead of using those, uh, just the, the big mug in the middle of the the you know the mug takes up the whole mock-up we've just found that overall we do so much better oh matthew everybody oh where do you get the enamel mugs uh oh those are big sellers those are a big deal and those are uh from randy where is it yeah this one right here and we've got a whole bunch of really cool flower mock-ups. We're going to be shooting a whole, but we're just, we will have like a couple thousand items in that store. Anyway, Matthew's products can just be dropped right on your mock-up. And you can put all 11 designs on each mug to find out which one's working. Put all 11 designs on the standard mug. Put all 11 designs on the tote bag. Uh, having the design pack and, you know, these mock-ups that Matthew insisted we give away uh, should help you out because these are the ones that we use. Uh, let's see. Um, let me just go here and grab something real quick. Let me see if I can find this one. Uh, let me go in here. And let me see if I can do this. Uh, change window. Yeah, I want to share this one. Okay, um, can you see the screen now, Matthew, that's showing off Renegade Lids? I do, yeah. Okay, so anyway, these are some of the things that we did. We set this up with automation through uh, Randy's apps so that the orders are auto-fulfilled. Um, let's see, we did uh, a whole bunch of things. Some worked, some didn't. It's a matter of trying enough things. And of course, you know, we did uh, all of these mock-ups. This one here, I thought was really funny. One of the Trump. Uh, and of course, Randy has the, the custom image upload on Shopify there. So it uh, looks really, really cool. And you'll see, let me see if I go here. Once again, you'll see our mock-ups. We shot these all, our, or I shot these myself. And anyway, this is one of the best sellers that we've had. And the other mega seller was the Trump. And let me see if I can find this. Just give me one second, I'll show you our best seller here uh let me because i don't believe that it is in there anymore but i can probably oh yeah yeah let me do this 
Can they see that one, Matthew? Yep, you got the uh, cartoon in Trump. Yeah, yeah, this was our the one that we had to shut off. We've got, we took, uh, Matthew found a photo from uh, Trump and who was the the other guy anyways thanking him from the podium and then what we did is we reached out to a fiber guy and he charges like i don't know three or four or five bucks i guess depending on how many we do and the customer would just give us a photo and then all he would do is just draw the head and it just gets dropped on this body uh although we had uh that's not the correct one because we changed the color of trump's suit yeah. yeah, and this is just yeah. a design that you can see. We did this one here for nurses and other industries as well. And that's one where he's got the, the blue suit on. And here, the body stayed the same. We just changed the, the cartoon head on there. And this is one that we just literally could not keep up with the sales. And we had so many. Oh, and this is what it looked like. Oh, yeah, that's what it looked like there. And let me see. Wow, well, yeah, that shows you exactly what it looks like. That was our big, big seller. And trust me, if you want a massive seller, uh, this one here is for dads. You could do this with any and all industries for the next six months. This thing will absolutely explode. That's what I was going to say, Kim. We're still getting messages from people asking us for that mug. <laughs> As well now. Oh man, this thing, it was a nightmare. It was just consuming. It was like, man, we were spending nothing. And what is the cost per conversion on this? I think we're running somewhere around 90 cents to a dollar on the high end. Of course, we had some days where we were running 30, 40, 50 cent conversions. Anyway, that was our big seller. Like I said, we don't mind showing our stores and what we're doing i know some marketers absolutely hate that idea but you know this is what we do this is what things need to look like and we just set this one up and you'll see that you know every single review on this store you know this this it goes a long way in having all these people say that we're awesome and when they say that we are awesome they basically mean matthew is awesome they think that uh, they think that I'm a jerk, but they think that Matthew makes this store wonderful. Anyway, uh, oh my goodness, great, 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 fast shipping, great artwork. Just wish I got a larger size cut. Well, keep wishing. We only have one size. <laughs> anyway, we've got all five star reviews. The customers love this crap. Randy did a fantastic job in fulfilling our orders for Father's Day uh, across not just this demo store, but across all of our stores. Wonderful job, wonderful human being. And let me just go back here to stop sharing. And I'm just gonna see what we have here for uh, questions to make sure. So the metal mugs are on the product list. I miss them somehow. I don't know if he has them on there. For everyone else, we have a number of products that others don't have. So uh, I will mention that to, I'll make a note here and I'll mention that to Randy because that is such a cool product. Uh, tin cups. Got it on the list. Is it okay to put them on Etsy? I know they're supposed to be handmade. No, uh, they're not supposed to be handmade. You are supposed to list Printec as your partner. Uh, you are the one putting the design on the mug. That is your contribution. There are piles and piles of sellers. So you just have to put Randy down, put Printec as your production partner. And let's see. Do you know when Randy will have the new products like the tin cup? Well, the tin cup I'll mention to him today. Okay. I uh, just got the Trump pack from Matthew's site and the four mock-up packs from the mock-up mall. Tremendous value. Tremendous. Really fantastic. Thanks, lads. 
Or in Matthew's case, wouldn't you say thanks, lads and lasses? Mm. Isn't that what you call the, the female? Uh, I just made my purchase on Etsy. Matthew thanks you. Uh, let me see. Where do I find it? Make sure you put that uh, the link to the mock-up mall in there again, Matthew, and the discount coupon code. Uh, would it let me leave a review right after purchase? Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. But as soon as your review, uh, just keep checking. And as soon as you can leave a review, it's normally within uh, hours, I believe. Then you can leave us a review and we can get you a 10-pack. The enamel cup, it's funny. Everybody wants that tin cup. Not just the marketers, the customers. Do the keyword research. Oh my goodness, the customers love those tin mugs. Yeah, here's one right here. Here's one right here. This is what they look like in real life. I always struggle with getting that even anyway that's what that bad boy looks like it's beautiful beautiful and yes we're shooting all the new mock-ups for uh, doing all the photography for new mock-ups uh and medford is going to have some of those available to the print deck people uh let's see where can i buy the trump design and personal picture mug get those links in there matthew get the link into your design pack is it in there Oh, you got it all in there. Keep that. Just copy and paste it. Let's see. Okay, that's about it. Do we have any other uh, questions? I think we got it covered, Matthew. Matthew Houghton. Uh, Pat said that she didn't get a download link when she bought the Trump pack. Uh, so, Pat, you can you use the live support on the website there? And just send me a message. I'm not sure why you didn't get it, but everybody else seems to be getting it. So just shoot me a message. I'll get you um, sorted out. Man, Matthew, this lady walks by my house like three, four times a day. And I think she's checking me out. Well, no, she's like, I think she's like about 105. She's but wondering. man, this lady moves at the speed of light. She's like a flash going. It's like, slow down, lady. She's wondering what you're doing with all those women's clothes. Yeah, that's right. When I have the garage door open and they're all hanging up in there. <laughs> that's when I've got the big beard. I make sure I shop for those clothes when I got the beard going. Uh, yeah. Let me see. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Any last, can the packs be used in two different locker stock accounts? With uh, Princex, I'm trying to get it integrated with them. So when anyone buys a pack, it will shoot straight into your account. And they, they want to limit it to one account per thing but anybody who buys on this webinar is set when you see was just make a note that you're on webinar and I'll get it added into multiple locker stock accounts for you. Yeah I like this one right here Gail says thanks you guys I almost did not watch this because I am so not a Trump fan. What a mistake that would have been so true. I mean man we actually promoted some anti-Trump stuff. <laughs> it was just so friggin' funny. We just couldn't sell it. <laughs> I wish I could have. Uh, let's see. Uh, Ernest just made his purchase. That is fantastic. Anyway, we have, we're going to stick around for another four minutes. And then Matthew, he just, that's when he shuts things down. It's like, I have to go and walk my dogs. And I have to go hang out with my wife because this is the start of their evening. Uh, it's a bit of a cuckoo country. But, uh, you know, they're eight hours ahead. Who's starting their evening right now? You should be starting your morning fresh and alert. Anyway, the cuckoo country, I mean, they're just getting ready for their big evening. <laughs> so when it comes to 5 p.m. in the U.K., Matthew, he just he won't even check for messages on Skype. He just... If you need support in in the evening, I'll tell you, he's British AF. I was laughing at John Cowser's comment. He said, and Rob, the post office. Well, I don't know if he knows my wife owns post office or not. <laughs> <laughs>
Uh, Wendy's asking when they'll show up in a locker stock account. So just briefly, anybody who's having um, a locker stock push at the moment, this is how it works. Um, you'll submit your uh, locker stock username to me and your email. I will then pass that over to lock to Printex or Printex, and they will do the push into there. So it'll be as quick as I can, uh, you know. But once I've passed over to them, it's kind of in their hands. But like I say, we're trying to get this as an automated process so that there won't be any delay. But for now, I need to just pass those details over, and they will just shoot those into your account. And Matthew will get that on as quickly as possible. Don't be bad mouthing the Brits. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Wow. Who else could I pick on? Mm -hmm. I, I love the, the Irish. Oh, I love the girls in Ireland. The girls in Ireland, I'll tell, well, I don't know how many girls. I just know one girl from Ireland, but beautiful country, beautiful country. It's producing beautiful people. And in the UK, Matthew's wife, good looking lady, beautiful people. I've told Matthew, so many beautiful people come from, I think, I always wanted to go to, to England. I wanted to go to Britain. I wanted to go to Wales because all of these great looking um, ladies from the country and Matthew said, don't be fooled. Those are the people in Hollywood from Britain. They don't all look that way. I thought they did. Oh, my wife. Uh, let me see. Wait once. Okay. I need some macho t-shirt mock-ups in your mock-up store. Well, we are going to, if all goes well, we will do some t-shirt mock-ups today and they will be part of the mock-ups that we shoot over to you because I know a lot of people want t-shirts and mugs and we're gonna make sure that you get lots of t-shirts and mugs in that bonus pack. And you guys can thank Matthew for all of that because I said, screw it and he said, no. He said, well, we're going to do something great. Okay, yeah, we'll get you some T-shirts in there. Anyway, look, we're down to two minutes. If you've got a question, ask quick because we'll be talking away and Matthew is just going to hit the end webinar button. There will be no goodbye, nothing. Yeah. When it's 5 p.m. In, in the U.K., well, he shuts her down. <laughs> well, it's like they said on that film, you can't even get drug dealers to work on the weekend. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> Uh, Mike's asked a question, like, how do we get the locker stock ID to Matty? So when you buy that pack, you'll get an email and inside that email will be v training videos and explanation videos. If anything goes wrong whatsoever, use the live support on the designs for print on demand website. Okay, everything can be done through live support. Okay, and there is once again, a number of messages. Uh... My good friend, Robert, this isn't a support desk. When you say that my I only have 50 of my 100 keys, unfortunately, it's not a support desk. Randy has 50 in there, and if you sold your 50, Randy will be putting the rest in shortly. That would be his delay. Um, there was one package that was lost, or but now is found. It was lost, but now is found. Anyway, um, maybe Randy just has to add it there. So anyway... All good. Oh, it looks like we're down. Oh, it just hit 5 p.m. in the UK. We're out of here. Thanks for being here. Take care, everyone. Have yourselves a great day. We'll talk soon. Okay, bye, guys.